In Excel 2010, if you add more than one value field, those fields will be arranged horizontally. Here we just have units. We can see it in the values area. I'm going to also add total. To do that, I'll add a check mark here and it appears in the layout. The headings are horizontally across the top of the pivot table. If you'd like them arranged vertically so that you see binder and then sum of units and below that sum of total, you can use the field list. Coming over to the field list, here's the values button and I will drag it down into the row labels area, putting it below the item field. Now we can see each item and then it's sum of units and sum of total. I've got this pivot table in the outline form. So if we go to the pivot table tools and click design in report layout, I'm using outline form. The default form is compact. So this is how it would look in compact form. You could also put the values above the other fields. So we can now see the sum of units and then each item, sum of total in each item. And to put it back into a horizontal arrangement, just drag the values back to the column labels. And now we see the headings across the top. For more Excel tips and tutorials, please visit my Contextures website at www.contextures.com.